What's going on Star Wars fans? You're watching The Collector's Hut. My name is Chris and we're going to be taking a look at The Force Link. So originally I wasn't planning on picking this up, but the awesome people over at Hasbro sent it over to me and that amazing promotional box for Star Wars The Last Jedi and I was really stoked to see it in there because I was really curious to see how this device was going to interact with these figures and it ended up being pretty damn cool and I had a lot of fun. So with that being said, let's get right to this review. Right off the bat, it comes with a Kylo Ren figure that's really nice. I'll bring that nice and close so you guys can check it out. But let's talk a little bit about the Force Link. So it runs on three AAA batteries. You remove this screw, put the batteries in, put the screw back, you're good to go. Basically, to activate it, you just have to hit it. That noise indicates that it's on, and then these little orange lights. And basically, you're good to go. Now... I didn't read the directions at first because I wanted to dive right in. There's a little force link symbol on the bottom feet of each figure, so I just thought that you put it right on here like a stand and it would activate and I was definitely wrong. So I had to look at the directions, look at some pitches, and it looks like it wants you to hold the figure and tilt your wrist back and that activates it, but it doesn't work every time. What I found works every time is that the chip is actually located in the chest and the back of each figure, so as long as you point this right at it, it will work every time. So as you can see, I had no trouble, it worked every time, and it is a lot of fun. Now, if you're one of those collectors that keep figures in the package, if you're wondering if you could use the Force Link with figures in the package, you definitely can, and I love that feature because I do keep a lot of figures mint in package. So we'll try Luke. May the Force be with you. I love that you can enjoy this with still having your figure in the package. That was Paige. I can fix anything. And that was Rose. So let's get right to the Kylo figure, but at first we'll bring the package nice and close so you can check that out. So the package is pretty sweet. It basically tells you everything you, you really need to know. This kid looks like he's ready to potty. And on the side, you know, you, you could use it on your figures, your vehicles, and the creature, the Wrath Tire which is really nice. It's really cool that you can use it on the vehicles. I wasn't expecting that. On the back is a lot of other Star Wars products. Um, this playset looks really cool with that Snoke figure. And like always, you have that Disney and Hasbro logo on the bottom right. So the overall package is pretty sweet. And since I'm here, let's take a look at it up close. So obviously, that's the Force Link. It has like a little um, Velcro elastic band, fits around your wrist really nice. And you see those little orange lights lighting up. So it's pretty cool. Let's get right to the Kylo figure. So it's a great figure. You can remove this cape. It just clips right on the back of his neck. And all these 3.75s, they're um, 5 POA. So we'll start off with the head, left, and right. A little up and down, little side to side, but not so much. The arms go up and down. Same with the legs. And as you can see, there's a the little force link symbol, which is a great location. It's uh, totally out of sight. Lightsaber looks fantastic. So yeah, I mean, I really do like this feature a lot. Now that I have this, it is a lot of fun. And I think this retails for like $25, and it comes with this figure. So um, I think it's a pretty good deal. And I think places like Target already have it uh, on sale. I think I saw it for like $22. I could be wrong. But um, so you guys could check that out if you want, if you're really interested in this.
but yeah, it's pretty cool. And I'm pretty sure you guys already figured this out if you have the force link that the chip is in the chest in the back. Really great figure. It's basically the unmasked body with just a helmet on. So basically it's that figure next to Chewie with the helmet on. Really sweet. All right, guys. Let's just run through this one more time. So yeah, I mean, as you can see, if you have a lot of figures, you can have a lot of fun and definitely annoy somebody that's in the house. So guys, thank you so much for tuning in. If you want to see more of me, go to thecollectorshut.com. You can find me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, right here on YouTube. Please subscribe, comment, and share. I love hearing from you guys. And definitely keep tuning in because I have so much more to share with you guys. Um, like always, may the force be with you. Thank you so much, and I will see you soon.